This is my 2015 E63 AMG S, and today I'll show you why this murdered car is a murderer's car. Let me explain. It's not the blacked out headlamps and gloss surfaces, but this E63 AMG came murdered in every single panel from factory. The only non-black component are the red brake calipers, which really just add to the effect. They're the blood dripping from under the hood. It will even drive itself temporarily. As you see, I'm coasting and it's keeping me in lane. But by no means is this car comfortable to murder someone in. It has bladders in the seats which actually hug you when you're cornering hard. So a stabbing would be pretty tough. And it does have the power to get you away from a crime scene quickly, albeit loudly. This one's on loan from Dexter down the street, and it's perfect. Its 360 degree camera system allows a complete view of the car's surroundings, as well as a top-down view. The perfect cure for your paranoia of the police. It's got heated and cooled seats to keep your prison wallet happy. And even space in your glove box for, oh, oh, that won't do. This hungry beast consumes a gallon every six miles at full torque, and in race start mode, it goes zero to 60 in 3.4 seconds. I can't say I have much in common with a murderer, but oh, I love his taste in engines. This 577 horsepower, 5.5 liter bi-turbo V8 engine is hand-built with the blood, sweat, and tears of the man whose signature resides on it. I'm driving the four-wheel drive S version of the normal AMG. That means grip through corners and gunshots on the downshifts. All this power means it's also not very green. From the carbon fiber dash to its 577 horsepower engine, this car is approaching perfection in an era that's leaving it. But that's not why this is a murderer's car. This car murders with its looks, its refinement, and its meticulous attention to detail. It truly redefines what a muscle car can be. In the meantime, I wouldn't care if it tore my face off or stole my money. I'm in love with this brute, and I'm gonna enjoy the hell out of owning it.